All right. <clears throat> a lot of you guys said I have to do last resort reimagine next. Well, I'm here to do it. Some of you even said it would blow my mind like the other one. I don't know that that's possible. I got to be honest, guys. I, I don't know that that's possible. This does look like some inception type stuff that's that's going on here. So uh, let's check it out. Let's see what we got. Starting off with the strings. Cut my life into pieces. This is my last resort. Suffocation, no breathing. Don't give a fuck if I cut my arm bleeding. This is my last resort. I'm, I almost already forgot that I've seen this dude rap really well. Do his, you, some of you said screamo is not the right word. Do, do his rock thing. And now I'm seeing him play a piano and sing. What's next? Well, what's next, man? Come on. Wow. Cut my life in. My last resort, suffocation, no breathing Don't give a fuck if I cut my arm bleeding Do you even care if I die bleeding? Would it be wrong or it be right If I took my life tonight Chances are that I might Mutilation out of sight And I'm contemplating suicide I'm contemplating suicide I'm losing my sight, losing my mind. Wish somebody would tell me I'm fine. Losing my sight, losing my mind. Wish somebody would tell me I'm fine. I am fine. So I'm not entirely, I know, I know, terrible time to pause it, I know, look, I'm not sure what to make of these six, is it six? Yeah, these six kind of like, um, not Colossus, but these, these stone-ish figures, like these stone-esque figures, um, playing the strings, you know, we got two on cello and then four playing violin here, um, yeah, I'm not really sure what to make of that, but right when he says, tell me I'm fine, and then, then the buildings start crumbling, I, I'm not entirely sure what to make of that, but let's just keep going here. I never realized I was spread too thin Till it was too late and I was empty within Feeding on chaos and living in sin Downward spiral, where do I begin? That note did it guys you guys got me goose bumping up in here um wow yeah i'm curious i'm curious to know more man let's keep going So if you guys have ever been in a similar place that he's talking about and some of you said this this was a like a sort of a like a quasi cover I don't know if that's true or not I'm just going to go off of what's in front of me I like doing the blind reactions but look if you've ever been in that spot it it almost feels like what this music video is doing where the world is crumbling around you it seems like everything's falling apart I mean 
you could be having a bad week and then at near the end of that bad week you have a really bad day and and um it's not even just that i mean some some i've gone through years of my life where they were you know quote bad years you know people talk about a bad day i've gone through some of that and and this definitely um does a good job in my opinion of capturing um kind of what that feels like and as he's hitting these really powerful notes with the strings behind it you see um you know you see the buildings falling and, and the world's crumbling around him um you know, I, I think that in and of itself, aside from from the poetry and aside from the piano and aside from, um, you know, the poetic elements within the music, the video itself, it, it's very poetic to see those um, those buildings fall. So let's keep going here. <laughs> Again, woo, woo, man, he calmed it down just so he could hit you with that at the end. Also, how how incredibly versatile. I mean, I've come across a few different artists that are, are really, really versatile in the past six months since I've really been doing this channel. And I'm amazed at, at how many different genres they can touch on. Not even just genres, but, but different moods that they can, um, you know, elicit through their words and the music. Um wow like i like it, it's it's almost like that watch the world burn video is a separate world in and of itself compared to this wow Somebody Because in the, no, no, because in the, no, 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 no. In the end of Watch the World Burn, it was the world blowing up. And then this, it's, it's the world unexploding, imploding, or, or, you know, reorganizing itself. What the fuck, man? See, I thought this was a completely separate, like, in, and I, I chose those words, like, that was spawned, like, oh, it seems like it's a separate world, like, it, it just seemed like a complete shift from before, and then he's almost tying this all, all together again. See, because my, my only problem with the Watch the World Burn, I mean, call it a problem if you want. It's very dark. The ending is very dark, and to me, I, you know, I, I'm naturally an incredibly negative person. So I and I've listened to that watch the world burn. I've listened to it over and over and over. I really like it. Um, it but it does leave me with that, you know, that that anxiety like there's something there's something wrong like the you know, the, it gives me like this the world is in, uh, is going to end a feeling. 
Wow, man. There's another one after this. What What's going to happen next? I forgot all the comments I was going to make. I mean, he does, um, he does mention in the song about, um, man, I could barely even think right now. It's just, just that two seconds, just that two seconds, all my thoughts gone instantaneously, not even close. They're just missed. He talked about, you know, he didn't, didn't realize it was, um, things were wrong until it was too late. Um, that's not the exact wording I know, but, um, that's definitely one of the, one of the things, you know, I, I don't talk about it a lot on the channel, but, um, one, I'll just say one of the internal struggles I do have uh, in one of, well, the best way I've overcome a lot of my struggles is, is to recognize, um, the warning signs that something is wrong. Um, and it's incredibly difficult to do because for me, I had to get out of a shit mentality, a shit, a shit life, just a, a, a hopeless life. I had to get out of that. And occasionally I catch myself slipping back into that. And the only thing that holds me back is there are these certain things that when I start having certain thoughts or behavior patterns or this and that, I'm like, okay, hang on, something's off. And then I, I start doing things that are you know, like for me, it's it's diet and exercise and, um, you know, focusing on my breathing. That helps me a lot. Um, you know, I, I mean, I could talk about that. I mean, obviously, you know, he talked about, um, you know, ending his own life. I'm not a I wish I could say I'm a stranger to those um, to those thoughts. And I've I've um, as, as many of us have, you know, I've been impacted by um, friends taking their own lives. And it's um, it's incredibly difficult. You know, it kind of blows a hole through your life and, you know, you're, you're left to somehow try to rationalize it. But um, it's it's a very real thing. And one th I, I try not to the main reason I'm hesitant to talk about it on the channel is because I'm I don't want my channel to become a pity party for people who are like that, like. It sounds cruel, but I don't want it to become a pity party where, where people are just like, I, I don't know. I don't want people to pity me first and foremost for, for the things I've gone through and what I struggle with and, and overcoming it. I, I don't want I don't want to be pitied for it. Um, and I also don't you know necessarily want to create like a, a culture on the channel of, um, you know, glorifying because I, I see a lot of glorification and very loud, like almost celebration of of mental health disorders. And personally, for me, it's like, look, I know I will lose subs over this probably. But for me, it's, it's definitely a thing of like, man, I, I've been dealing with that since I was eight or nine is when when the, the thoughts of I don't. Like, what would it be like if I wasn't alive? I don't want to be here. Um, I, I don't want to actively do it, but I'd be okay if I died. Like, that started at 8 or 9 for me. And so, you know, I, it wasn't until I was about 21 or 22 that I, I really was able to overcome. Um, and not overcome, but learn to manage um, a lot of that and figure out what the source was and deal with that. And so, for me, I, I'm not... I am not one of these people who's um, a fan of um, glorifying a certain and, and once again, I know some people are going to misconstrue it, but I genuinely I, I'm not a fan of celebrating uh, a mental health disorder or a certain uh, struggling like say if it's anorexia or bulimia or, or um, you, you know, whatever it is, I, I don't. But like, I, I don't think you should hide it. I, it definitely should not be shunned. OK, I'll say that I should have said that in the beginning. It definitely should not be shunned. But I also think equally we made this pendulum swing. I call it a societal overcorrection. And what happens is we notice something bad in society like mental health is neglected in people in general. Um, that's the bad thing. And what we do is there's this pendulum and we do a societal overcorrection to let's talk about it never judge anyone for anything never give anyone advice on anything because you don't know what they're going through and that's not i i'm not down with that and i know that's gonna piss some people off but oh well um i'm gonna wrap this one up i mean I, I, there was so much packed into there um 
so I'm kind of dissecting it at the end of the video if, if you guys did like it um you know let me know it's it's hard to know but at the end of the day I'm gonna do the channel how I want it and I like to pause I like to analyze and I like to externally process things sometimes and and I found a lot of other people do too so um wow man I I can't like I don't know what's gonna come next but I'm incredibly interested that's for sure um just that that three to five what, what was it three four seconds where it's the, the the world that was burning and blowing up is now coming back together and orderly now I don't know what the trigger was but um I might have to rewatch it and figure that one out uh to figure out what the trigger for it reorganizing itself was but look guys I'm gonna wrap this one up thank you for watching if you did like it like subscribe comment recommend um shoot a comment comments are great i love comments um because it, it lets me know what you guys are thinking and hey you know i want more of this less of this you know i i do read the comments i a lot of it it's, i'll be honest not a lot of it a very small percentage of it is just like literally garbage like nonsense i did the wrong i did watch the world burn and i made a short of it and on the short that i did I got a bunch of comments from people talking mad shit about Ronnie. They were like, oh, he's a really bad guy. Ronnie's not a good guy. Ronnie this, Ronnie that. I'm like, look, man, I don't I don't know what the situation is there. I, I, I they commented because I was like, wait, well, like, what's the problem? You know, I'm, I'm one of those people. It's like, well, what happened? What's the problem? What do we know? Um, and they said a few things. I'm like, well, is there evidence of it? Like what what? was he just arrested for something like what you know and i'm also a big fan of redemption too i mean i'm glad that i, I actually did this because it let it gives um a brighter perspective to watch the world burn um because it ends very dark and so you know i'm a big fan of redemption and progression progression as human beings um i mean i've done so many shitty things in my life um i've treated people terribly when i was younger um, I, I was incredibly selfish and now I'm at a point where I'm able to raise a child and be a somewhat decent parental figure like it's um, I'm a huge f fan of redemption. I'm not a fan of it. I, I, I believe that people are not a single action. And so, you know, in this day and age, we want to think, you know, one person does one thing and then they're this. It's like, well. Okay, you know, they, they should be held accountable, sure, of course. But does that define them as who they are and then therefore, you know, I, I'm going to wrap this one up. I'm just banging on about nonsense at this point, guys. But um, hit like, subscribe, comment, recommend. Thank you guys for tuning in. Hell of a music video.